Hey guys, RC here. Welcome back. We're going to take a look in this episode at some highlights from the quarterfinal of the Pokal Cup. We open up the scoring with an Aslani penalty just before halftime to make it 1-0. Ponovic breaking into some open space. Hunter and Aslani giving him runs. And he squares it across, but he beats the keeper. I think Aslani could have made a touch had he wanted to, but Ponovic makes it 2-0. And just another minute later, uh, this is Arndt, the new player, comes in, and Hunter gets it past the keeper, Eswine, and makes it 3-0 in the 48th minute. And that's not going to do it all. Takahashi. Not the quickest player we can see, but he does control it well. It goes across, and it's headed into the goal. Coley makes the run. No, I'm sorry. It was Quang Hyun, uh, his second goal that we've seen. Uh, last episode, he got his first goal for the club. 22 shots to 9. We trailed on possession again, but again, a dominant 4-0 win. That's two clean sheets for our new keeper. And he was man of the match last match. So we win in the quarterfinal. We pick up $2 million. Ponovic does a good job. We are going to go that route. And taking a look at the schedule, catch you guys up on games. Since Union Berlin, we only had the one match against Fortuna Dusseldorf. 3-1 uh, as Lonnie with two goals aren't playing in the number 10 like he did today. Uh, gets another goal, and we are on a good run of form. That is what, one, two, three, four, five, six league matches in a row without a loss. And a couple of cup wins. We are into the semifinals. Don't think they have finished that yet. I don't think we've had the draw for that yet. No, this will be drawn on March 9th. But we know who's in it. It'll be us, Bayern Munich, Fortuna Dusseldorf, and Borussia Dortmund. So that is the final four. We'll play one of them in the semifinals. I wasn't going to come back this quick. So I just wanted you guys to see the highlights there. So we will come back uh, in a little bit. Not sure where, but in a little bit. All right, we are back for today's match against Grunther Firth. I have no idea. Speg? I have no idea, but we'll call him Grunther Firth. Uh, we had the 4-0 win over Dresden, a 0-0 draw with Holstein Kiel, and a 3-1 defeat to Borussia Dortmund. And we got the lone goal from Robert Cernan, who was back. We did get called out in the media for not starting. You can see we started um, Cernan and Amar and Arndt, and they were wondering why we did not play Alani. Because we couldn't play all three of them. I guess we could. We just have to figure out how to do it. Uh, we do have some injury issues to deal with. So uh, let's see. Abbas is suspended. Uh, for accumulation of cards. Yopek, 5 to 12 more days, pulled a hamstring in training. Gislaine injured with a broken foot in that Borussia Dortmund match. He'll be out two to three months. Strakura also out two to four weeks with a groin strain in training. Jack Hunter is out for about another two weeks from a hamstring strain. Oh my goodness. Things are just starting to fall apart. All right, I want, we're going to go that route. Now, if I look at Arndt, he's actually just as good as Sam or anybody else. He's a better finisher. I think that gives us our three best scoring options. Although, Arndt does have one goal. He has gotten his first goal for the club. So uh, that is something to do. Uh, but we're going to be going with Aslani and Cernan up top. Cernan's back into fitness. Aren't in the number 10. Uh, do I want him out there? Not really. Oh, Jack Hunter. He's on the bench, but not really able to play. Yeah, so he, he's on the bench for emergency. In fact, let me just take him off. We'll go a player short today. I'd just rather not, not risk it. Uh, we also are training somebody. Who are we training? Amara. 
Abbas Kramer Strachura, I believe, uh, just got called up to the club. Uh, he had a birthday. He's too old for the, the youth squad now. And we're training him at that deep line. He's actually a very good defender, but he's short. He's 5'10". So he's a, he's a center back by trade. I'm going to retrain him as a, a deep line playmaker. And we'll go that route with him. Kwong Hyun, lacking fitness. But we will make do with that. And let's get to it. Not even a kickoff highlight, so that's good. All right, we're going to encourage the team. Kramer starts the build from the back on the first highlight of the episode. We do have early crosses on, trying to uh, limit. Yeah, I'm not sure what the hell that was. Trying to limit balls into the defender's legs. We'll see what it does. That's through. Cernan lays it in. It's Arndt, and he puts us up his third goal of the season. And we're up 1-0 in the sixth minute. What a play. Cernan with the assist. That strike partnership is really looking good. Very, very good start. Yanderson is just, is it Yanderson or Janderson? I'm thinking it's Yanderson. Um, you guys know anything for sure on pronunciation in uh, South America. Because remember, he's Brazilian. So possession, we're still lacking. That happens. We force a play all the way back to the keeper. And they turn it back up and find some room. And what a save. He can't get to it, but he got the block, knocked it away from the goal. I'd rather that than out in front of the goal where it could just be tapped back in. There's a nice header out. Can Arndt chase it down? He can. He's got some room. Saren's coming up on the right side trying to give him somebody to play to. And I don't know why Arndt went down with a slide tackle, but I guess that's an option, right? Oh, what a save by Yanderson there. Oh, big header by Truska. Run it down. There you go. Oh, Amara just killed Arndt, hit him in the back of the head. Ponovich finds a little space, makes a run to the middle of the field. All the way up. He's taken down in the box. That's got to be a penalty. Referee's going over to the television. He's got somebody talking in his ear as well, I am sure. Checking for a penalty. And it... It... What's the call? It's a penalty! Yes, all right. Who's going to take it for us? It's going to be Aslani. He sat out that last match. Remember the press lambasted us and he slots it home and that makes it 2-0 in the 17th minute, his 14th goal of the season. I don't think we need to watch a penalty replay. That's, that's a little uncalled for. Ponovich, oh, that's going to be a red card. He might get sent off. I think he is gone and it is a straight red. Oh my goodness. Uh, okay, Arndt. Okay, Aslani. We're going to pull Aslani back. Tell you what, let's do this. Is that what I want to do? I don't know if that's what I want to do. Mara, Kramer. Decisions, decisions. Tell you what, I'm going to keep that. We're going to go to that. What foot is he? He's a left foot. He, he should. Can he dribble? Yes. He can pass. He can cross. He should be able to play winger. It's not a natural. I get it. He's just as good. You know. Yeah. And we're going to go. We're going to go to cautious. And we've already collapsed our lines. I did that. We're going to collapse a little bit more here. 
We're in regroup, slow the pace down. I don't want I don't want to play for set pieces yet. But we're slowing the pace down. We'll start wasting time. All right, let's encourage them here. Why is this not coming off the screen? Isn't it supposed to? I thought I seem to recall as Lonnie goes near post, I was sitting there looking at that and I missed the fact that we had an attack. So maybe we're not, well, we're going to ignore that. All right, I'd really just like halftime to get here really quick. Well, we are. We, we're, no, we're not going to do that. We're going to ignore that. We've already, we've already pulled back a lot. All right, come on. Keep them on the outside. There's a clearance. Nice. Good job by the defense. At least it wasn't one of our defensive players. Oh, Cernan, can he get through the defense? He takes a crack from the edge of the box. It's a good effort. Maybe another step or two, but he had two defenders on him. But we're going to hold on to that 2-0 lead heading into halftime. I think that is a victory in and of itself. All right, what do we want to do? We're going to go outstretched arms. I'm delighted with your performance. Keep it up. Uh, let's, let's praise. All right, there's Saren. Lays it back. Sahin. He's our lone wonder kid, remember? From Turkey, right? Turkish wonder kid? Aren't looking for some space. There's a cross. Oh, and it just goes wide as Lonnie with a nice effort. Oh, that would have been brilliant. I would have felt so much better with another goal here. We're already being cautious. All right, we're going to ride this. these players. They're playing well. All right, there's our first guy going red. We're going to go ahead and pull him off. Who is that? That's Quang Hyun. And we'll bring Baz on for him. And that's going to be in the right mid. All right. They make a double switch. Oh, uh, Bird Camper. He's got a counter opportunity. He's got two guys. A lot of space out there. Oh, what a save by Yanderson. I think that was a shot, not a cross, but DeBosque was making that run in to the right of the box. Oh, that was not good. Oh, and Rat Rat Ratasevich beats Yanderson. That could be costly. That could be costly. All right, let's. Cernan's playing well. As Lonnie, I tell you what, let's bring Art. No, we're not going to do that because I don't have anybody out there. Tell you what, let's bring Kramer up, and then we'll bring Stover in on that back line. Robert, Kramer's a, uh, he's not the best passer. Is it Gunderson? Yeah, Gunderson's more, can go right back, though. But let's do that. That'll get a fresh, fresh body in the center of the back line. Takahashi? Sam? Most of these guys are more attacking which is one thing this tactic's weak at because we've got guys that would have to play out of position. Uh, passing, first touch. Tell you what, mid. Let's bring him on for Art. It's out of position, but he's got skills. Sometimes you just have to hope players can do the job. Let's, uh, let's tell him to focus. Three minutes of stoppage time. Can we pull it out? He blasts that out. I don't like when they play around like that deep in the box with a lot of defenders around. Oh, shit. And they break us open. It's Truska. Oh, uh, shit. I don't think we lose this game if we've got a full contingent of players on the field. 
I mean, we pulled back, we went cautious, we did just about everything we could do. I think that was just unlucky. That that last goal was a brilliant play by them. Um, unlucky boys just wasn't our day. Straight red card. There will be a two-week fine coming for him. You can see we're on 41 points after 24 matches. Falling off the point per game match a little bit. Still within nine points of Bayern, which I think is outstanding. And we've got a seven-point lead over uh, Guther, Guther Firth, uh, who we just played, right? So seven points, and that's all in European qualifying. Uh, yep, fine. Two weeks wages. As Lonnie is one goal away from his goal bonus. Stover will make his 20th appearance. We have to pay $2.2 million on that. I'd rather not do that if I could avoid it. But, you know, there's not a whole lot you can do. You've got to, you got to do what you got to do. All right, I did want to look in here. Bundesliga rules. And we're where? Should have looked first. Sixth. That puts us into Euro Cup. And 95 and basically 96 million dollars. And if we can somehow crack fourth, that puts us into Euro into Champions League at 124 million. That would not suck. And we're only four points off of that. It's doable. But we have got to continue winning games. And we are running out of window. So I guess we'll come back. Tell you what, I'll come back. We'll look at, we'll see how we do here. If uh, I'll record the game. But depending on how we do in here and then afterwards, I don't want to see Shalka again because we just did the Chalka with Shalka episode. So. Oh man, I'd like to I'd like to have something wrapped up before we face. Actually, that's Leverkusen, that's not Munich. How do you tell the difference? FC Bayern and ba Bayer 04. That Bayern Munich Bayer Leverkusen. I got it. Okay. Takes me a little while. All right. So, I would yeah, that wouldn't be bad. That's not a horrible run in. FCN is, is going to be tough. So, let's come back for the semifinal. We'll be able to recap how we're looking in the league, and then we can decide, is there a final in our future that we skip to, or do we have a match that could get us into Champions League, or is that already decided one way or the other? So expect highlights and then a match. What that match will be, we'll see. Hit that like button for me, guys. Thanks for hanging out. We'll talk to you next time. Bye.